It's a study that has astonished the medical world. Using a scanner like this, scientists reached into the mind of a man who'd been in a vegetative state for five years and communicated with him via his thoughts. It suggests some vegetative brain injury patients may have a degree of consciousness that has previously been undetectable. Dr. Stephen Lorris and his colleagues built on the fact that people use different regions of their question, brain depending on the subject of their thoughts. Area, the if they're cortex. imagining playing tennis, for so example, they use the motor so region. The yes, if they're the imagining the layout the of their home, they use sport. the spatial region. So you're going to see the team and set up a test. They asked the patients some simple yes or no questions and they said if the answer's yes, imagine you're playing tennis. And if the answer's no, imagine how your home looks. For each question, the scanner measured which bit of the brain the patient was using. And from this, they worked out that he got almost all the answers right. The team also detected awareness in four other patients, although in others, they detected nothing. It opens a new era where I think we need to prepare what we're going to do with this technology. We can ask big questions here. This will have major medical, ethical and legal impact. We need to think about how this will find its way to real life and to the clinical setting. But scientists emphasize all this is still at the research stage and the implications for patients and their families so have still to be determined. Martin Benedict, The Associated Press.